Sagittarius. Someone that's playing for you is, is, is escape plan. So you're trying to figure out how to get yourself out of a situation. Look, you want to take a leap of faith in a whole new direction because you've been presented with an opportunity. But in order for you to act on this opportunity and invest yourself, you got to end something. And you're trying to figure out how to pull yourself out of that. Whether it's a mental space you put yourself in, a perspective that people see you in that you're trying to get yourself out of. You don't want to be known or seen for this or you don't want to be known or seen like this to this person or these people. You're trying to change your image. Or you're trying to change the spaces you participate in. You don't want to be in this relationship anymore. You want to invest in a whole different type of relationship or a whole new different type of space. And in order for you to do that, you got to you gotta close this door before you can open the next. You feel me? That's what you're trying to figure out how to do. You're trying to figure out how to close the door. Because the door in front of you will not open. It's not budging. Because you, this door, you still participate in, in this door. You still got this door swung open. You got one foot in, one foot out. But yet you ready to go forward is what you claiming. Oh, that's what somebody claiming with you. Somebody might be trying to escape a situation. They caught up with a situation with Sagittarius. Somebody don't want to kick it with love. Well, I told you, you wanna you don't you don't want to do that anymore. It sounded like your last one. E easily. You don't want to participate in this type of energy anymore. Or if it's only the first card, you could be participating in an energy that now you in a situation. It's like you've been doing something where you carried out a current, a current, a certain type of characteristic that got you caught up because you was being a little demon, and you wasn't even being like professional. You was being a, a not even a smooth criminal. You was a stupid criminal, that type shit, and you got caught up. You was sloppy as hell. But you thought you 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 thought you was you thought you was Sly Cooper out this bitch. You feel me? Put your foot in the shoe that bitch. Now you should yeah, look judge nine to judgment call. If, okay, that's the second card. So if it's yeah, if it's you versus you, sun's on the bottom. If it's you versus you, you made a judgment to not do something anymore or not participate in a certain type of energy or bring your mind there. I'm not gonna express myself like this because you got burned in the past if it's you versus someone outside of you you took a certain type of immature action again you thought you was sly cooper you was goofy cooper and you tripped while you was trying to do something or get away with something or sneak you feel me it was just like you were trying to plant a certain type of seed in order to yield a certain type of fruit you got judged because of that it's like you got caught by someone's higher consciousness someone was just watching your actions and your actions how you were carrying yourself or how you were in investing and or expressing your energy and emotions how you were investing your mind in the space gave it away you got caught now you're trying you may be trying to figure out how to escape that light again you don't want to be seen like this for that anyway but judgment was already called so you already got branded with that form four eight twelve three you might be dealing with a gemini it's four for four or this is pertaining the space you share with somebody i told you i'll change i don't know that i didn't hear that look stay it's the song that's playing for you see look you if it's you versus someone outside of you, it's like someone outside of you called the judgment because you was acting immature. You was acting like a goofy. Now you don't want to do that no more, but you it's like but that's after you got caught. You wouldn't you wouldn't want to change if you didn't get caught. But you got caught. So now look, now you feel left out from somebody or something because you got judged. Now look, it's making you look at all the shit you reflecting heavy now. I'll be fucked up if you can't be right here. Look, you changed your perspective because you've been judged. By your own mind, you're, you were doing something and your mentality was eating you up while you was doing it. You, you had voices telling you, why, why are you doing this? You know you shouldn't be doing it. You feel me? That little voice was chewing you up while you was doing something. Now you, it's like now you may be in whatever you were doing and you you feel it's like it's cold there. Because you, you wasn't supposed to be doing that in the first place. Or you did something to somebody, if it's you versus someone outside of you, you did something to somebody outside of you, you got caught by their higher self, whether it's like, again, 
that you your energy, the way your energy was giving off signals, the way you you were communicating verbally or energetically or with body language gave someone's spirit awareness to leave this situation alone with you. Now you don't want to do what you were doing anymore. Every girl in the world is the song that's playing for you. So listen. Shit, you probably thought you was a map. I'm going to be honest with you. That's what it's smelling like. And, and you thinking you could do have with any, any girl, any feminine energy, whether you was a female, you thought you was a map, or you was a dude and you thought you was a map. All that shit got caught, all that shit caught up with you. All that shit caught up with you. You thought you was a player from the Himalayas. Played yourself. You liked her, you liked her too, you feel me? You liked him, you liked him too, and then until somebody walked away from you. And whatever walked away from you is what you actually wanted. And now you feel sad, you feel cold, that, that, that person cold to you now. Or you just feel left out from that. Look, you don't want to be fast no more. Let me, let, let, let me change up, because now you burden. You ain't, you ain't wanted to go down like this. Look, but look again, I, I told you, you thought you was the shit, wasn't you? You thought you was the shit and now you stink. And that's what you get. That's what you get. You lost what you wanted playing the games you was playing as Sagittarius. Because it looked like you was playing the game. Sagittarius, yeah, look, now you got the truth about where your stability is, where you're found, where it's like now you know what's real after you were being fake. And as a result of you being fake, someone removed themselves from a space with you or you got removed from a certain type of space. You can't go there no more. Mentally, you can't put yourself in that mentality anymore. You've been thinking like this all this time. It's like you've been back and forth from thinking like this to thinking like this. Carrying out virtues in this energy, carrying out virtues in this energy. You can't go back to the good energy. You stuck in this one now. You stuck carrying out these virtues. You stuck acting like this. You stuck thinking like this because you thought you could play both sides. You thought you could play the field and the field played the fuck out of you. Put your foot though. Well, let me tell you, can't tell you much. Can't tell you shit. You know if this is for you or not. If it's, look, if it's you versus someone outside of you, I see, you might have still been on a certain type of time though. But we, I'm gonna I'm give you a good, I'm gonna give you a good one. If it's you versus someone outside of you, you probably called the judgment on the situation with someone outside of you and you, the judgment you called, you decided you don't want to do it. I'm not going to do this relationship like this anymore. I want to grow. I'm ready to change. I'm ready to develop. I'm ready to transform in some way, shape or form, expand, if you will. And in order to expand, I got to contract. So you, you downsized on the bad habits, the immature, the tactless motions and moves you made. You stopped doing the, you stopped doing what you used to be doing. And someone emotionally walked away from you because this new you got them feeling cold because they, how they bonded or connected with you in the past was because you were carrying out certain virtues. You were acting a certain type of way. And but and the only reason you dropped that is because something happened to you that was a burden. You feel me? And that whatever happened to you made you quit. I'm not going to do this anymore. Now someone's leaving the space with you because they can't be fast with you no more. They can't steal from you no more. Or that's how y'all click. That's how y'all met. That's how y'all be. It's like in order for you and another energy to connect, y'all have to have common ground somewhere. This energy of you lying, cheating, and or stealing time, energy, or money, or whatever you were taking that wasn't yours and wearing as your own clothes, you were making up your mind with someone else's mind. If you and someone else linked up because y'all had that common energy, now you don't want to do that no more and you lost the common ground with somebody. Put your foot in the shoe that fits you. Look, you heartbroken or somebody heartbroken about you now. So whether you got dropped because you thought you could do whatever, you thought you could take, you thought you could play, 
or you not investing yourself like this anymore. You rebuild, you want to rebuild yourself. And in order for you to do that, you got to separate everything you manifested from the previous lifestyle you were engaging in. Mentalities, habits, and people. Put your foot in the shoe that fits you.